Good morning you guys and welcome back to my channel. Sorry if I'm not feeling, sorry if I'm not looking like actually alive. <laughs> I don't feel alive right now. I, to be honest, have been crying and vomiting this morning because I am so damn sick. Um, today I am like seven weeks and two days pregnant and we are uh, it's very exciting because we are going for my first scan um, So this is like my first scan ever um, Because the other pregnancies I never got to this stage. So this is like the first dating scan um, It's also very exciting because we have had suspicions that it could be twins um, when we did this IUI it was there was two really good eggs um, that were released so there is definitely a chance that it could be twins and because I've been just so freaking sick um, there's a chance it could be twins so we will hopefully find out that today I don't know I thought I would just vlog this because I thought it would make for a really interesting video to watch um, if we find out that today even if it's just one and the heartbeat's good and everything like that I'll be so happy but if it's two that's just gonna be like a bit crazy so I thought I would vlog it um, but we've got my mum my mum slept over last night um, so she's coming to the scan with us this morning it's like super early in the morning by the way um, we've got like a scan at 7 a.m. so that everyone can like go back to work after that so my mum's coming Doug's coming obviously and my sister's gonna meet us there as well because she wanted to come too hearing the heartbeat and maybe finding out if it's twins or just one um, today I'm I'm probably impartial either way not gonna lie we'll be a little bit shook if it is twins but I'll still be so happy um, and then a part of me is also like I feel like I might be a little bit disappointed if it's not twins so I don't know I honestly don't know how I feel I'll just be happy if there's a good heartbeat and everything so yes I'm gonna vlog today and take you guys along for an exciting day for us Look at these two big girls just waiting for some food, hey? You're just waiting for anything to drop. Evie just jumped up here herself. Look at their haircuts. You're so skinny. Look at how skinny you are. <laughs> we don't usually get it this short, but they had heaps of burrs and stuff from um, some prickles in the yard and stuff like that, so we had to cut it quite short. I think Evie looks pretty cute, but Sunny, I think looks a bit better as like a teddy bear hey you're still sweet you're still so sweet what do you think girls ready to be some big sissies sissy sissy <laughs> like that word a sissy and this is pretty much everything i can stomach right now dry without anything wonder white bread but the dog seemed to be very interested in it i promise it's not good you don't want this you don't want this I'm in mum's car with her because she's a horrible driver <laughs> and gets very nervous with directions and Doug is driving in his car so that we can separate ways when we get there. How are you feeling mum? Yeah good. What are you thinking? Two, one, wage your bets. I'm thinking two. What? <laughs> you actually are? Yeah but I'm sort of hoping Because I've been so sick, is that your inkling? No. Because lots of people get sick. Mum, mum was like, if it's two, I'm gonna have to quit my job. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I'm capable of two. Like I'm sure it'll be hard, but I'll be able to do it. You don't need to give up your career. <laughs> so dramatic. Doug and I have both been referring to it as them, mm. the kids, mm. like plur like plural, when we bring the kids home. Mm -hmm. But um, part of me is just like things like that just don't happen to us. I, you know how there's like a certain type of person that'll have twins? I just don't think we're it. Mm. So I think it's just one. We'll see. I'm happy either way. Me? No, I just took my foot off the brake. Okay, mum nearly just <laughs> ran into Doug oh in his own car as he's trying to lead us to <laughs> he just the fertility came place. He me. 
Yeah, because you said you wanted him to lead. I didn't. I and then you just revved on the spot. I didn't. I took it <laughs> for no off the reason. break and it revs. It gets forward. <laughs> Should I call Carly and see if she's running late? I feel like she is. She's always late. Yeah, I said that to her. I was like, we're not going to wait for you. Hey. Hey. Morning. Just check. I'm uh, six minutes away. Oh, okay. You're closer than us. You can have your scan right. first. Yeah, do you want your scan done first? <laughs> yeah, if you can. <laughs> it's an internal. <laughs> Hopefully there's some poopies brewing you can see. <laughs> it's an internal, just so you know. All right, have, have you not been? I'll keep my pants on. <laughs> <laughs> have you not been to the toilet yet? No, I didn't think I had any time, so I just jumped in the car. I'm recording. <laughs> Thanks for that. I'm recording this conversation. Bye. <laughs> okay, quick thoughts. One or two kids. Definitely two. Definitely That's two what boys. Mum said. Oh my God, don't say that. <laughs> Doug, don't say two boys. <laughs> One of each. One of and each. Heads are be Why is it big? everyone is saying <laughs> twins? Absolute watermelon. Everyone's saying twins. Okay, let's go. I'm nervous and I got a wee. Yeah. <laughs> this will be the first time we actually see something in there. Usually I just stare at my ovaries. <laughs> yeah, or the burger. Or the, yeah, the burger. Oh, the uterus. Oh, okay. The lining of the uterus. That's what that um, the guy that the guest used to say to us. Oh, that's a good burger. Look for the hamburger yeah. one. We've got patty, huh? Yeah, we've got a good patty. Yeah. yeah. All right. <laughs> I think I had a good patty this time. We've got a good patty. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and Doug's been sick. It's not because I'm sickness. Oh, I like chest. It up yeah. respiratory. Yeah, you have to stop kissing him. Yeah, mm. yeah I have. Separate rooms. I have. <laughs> yeah. I made him sleep on the couch. <laughs> yeah, I'm out. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Can you see it? Is it? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to see it. Okay. Oh. Let me record again. Oh my goodness, wow. that is nuts. It's alive. It's alive. <laughs> 44 bits per minute. Is that good? Excellent. 144. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So just Let's one. Let's look for the other one. <laughs> oh no, just one in here. Just it's one. just one. Yeah. one. Awesome. I lost the bet. I can keep my job then. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so we have a little heartbeat over here. That's, yeah. Oh yeah, I can see. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. so cool. Oh, look. Yeah. Mm. So, sorry. Oh, look at it. Is that the heart? That's yeah. the heart beating. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay, so I'm just going to give it. Oh, look at it. Yeah. So, one centimeter, seven weeks, one day, okay? Okay. So that's beautiful. So, that's spot on. Yeah. That's what we thought. Okay, cool. So, you have to take my word. 28th of July. Well, I haven't figured it out. You have. I did. <laughs> what was it? What was the day? Uh, 28th of July. Yeah, so this is baby's head here. This is the chest. This is the bum. Okay? Oh, little bottom. Yeah. Good job. Thank you. Good growing. Good growing. <laughs> Set that as my ringtone. <laughs> <laughs> So if there was twins, would they both be in there? Yeah, they'd both be. There'll be a different, different another sack, mm -hmm. another another one next to it. It's not hiding. <laughs> you have to be really sure. <laughs> no, no, I. Do, we do get surprises though. I have to say, but at this stage doesn't look like. I'll just look at the sides of me. One little baby. One. Baby. One baby. One manageable one baby. baby. <laughs> <laughs> what you got there? Can I take a picture? A little bunny rabbit. <laughs> In my tummy. It's an energizer bunny. <laughs> energizer bunny, that's what it looks like. Yeah. <laughs> that's what you can nickname. Yeah, bunny. How's the advent calendar going, buddy? Do you want to do the next one? Number nine. You're awake, Ali. <laughs> you want to pop another one? <laughs> Feeling done. I'm excited. I'm very excited. 
I was just saying. It's like a little, it's like a tiny little speck, but I already thought it was so cute. The fact that it looks like a little energizer bunny. Or like we were saying, it looks like Evie at the beach. <laughs> <laughs> when she's like running along gets really excited at the beach it looks like it was running because it looked like it had like four little legs did that motivate you a little bit to get through the sickness it did it did actually it made it a little bit more real rather than something just sucking the life out of me yeah. it's like okay there's actually something that needs me to be functioning good like it's relying on me sort of thing yeah. hearing that heartbeat honestly that is that like one of the top moments of your life, do you reckon? Yes. My heart actually sank a little bit. Like I was a bit like, my, it took my breath away a little bit when I, because I didn't think we were going to actually hear it. I thought we were just going to see it flicker, the little heartbeat, but then we actually heard it and it was like so good. It was it's, like really strong. It's a bit, I'm a bit numb because we wanted this so bad. And then and now it's, it's all here. so much, and then you just like quickly turn the page and you start talking about the next step. I know. You don't actually like get a chance to close all the challenge we had. Yeah. There's a lot of tears and a lot of pain. A lot of very sad to, times. Just to get to exactly what we just did. But like now seeing that and how strong it is, I don't like. I know it's still very early and stuff. I in my mind, there's no way that this is gonna go bad. Yep. Like, I'm like, nah, this is it. Yep. This is what we were trying for this whole time. So, I also got some medication for my sickness, which is really good. So, we're going to go and pick that up. So, hopefully, I can feel a little bit more human because they're a little bit concerned about um, me not keeping any fluids down and mostly hay because I've been a bit dehydrated. So, how are you feeling about only being one? Um... I'm, I'm just glad we found out. Like, we're yeah. all, we just guess and guess and guess. And yeah. You can kind of get your mind into some sort of, like, crazy scenarios. And then as soon as you find out the facts, I'm totally okay with one. Like, it's like... Yeah. I... I yeah. And it's a lot less risky, too. It's just with exactly... One. It's just sort of exactly how it should be. Just very strong results, obviously, that if there's only one. I wonder what happened to that second little egg. The strong one ate it. It just... I mean, it was absolute beast in there. Super strong baby. We got a strong little baby in there. Great, great form. Looks good. Strong beat. 154 beats per minute. Definitely came from the right over Right when you came up. <laughs> what did you... So I was like, I'm pretty sure my heart beats at about 154 oh, right. beats per minute. And Doug's like, uh, maybe if you had just, like done a crossfit workout or something even then i don't think it would be 154 that was like really fast it's really fast you'd know about it if it was 154 yeah okay i'm feeling nauseous so i'm gonna put the camera down then that was its heartbeat its legs and its ears <laughs> it's has a really strong heartbeat it's like 144 beats per minute which is very strong. That's very exciting. There's one centimeter big. Oh, well, it's not twins. Yeah. yeah. That's what hey guys, it is later in the day and I'm back in bed now. I've taken all my makeup off and I've just been lying down and stuff um, to rest up a little bit because, like I said, I haven't been very well and I actually had the worst sleep last night. Um, but yeah, this pretty much sums up. This pretty much sums up the pregnancy situation zero glam get your makeup off as fast as you can um, because yeah nothing worse um, but I just thought I would let you know as well so they have put me on some medication for my vomiting and nausea come here baby I got the dogs in here with me because it turned out that I am very dehydrated at the moment so um, because I just haven't really been keeping down much at all honestly I know pregnant women go through so much but this has been horrendous like it's not morning sickness it's all day sickness um, like I'm talking like I wake up I wake myself up out of sleep 
because I need to vomit. Like it's really not nice. And um, it's just like, I feel like I can't escape it. And I really wanted to do this without medication um, originally. Basically my doctor said that I was dehydrated. I'm not really keeping down much. And she was concerned about my, um, like not being able to keep down my UTI medication. If you guys have watched some of my other videos or like follow me on Instagram, I'm pretty open about having um, chronic UTIs. So it's something that I actually go and see a urologist about, like a specialist. Um, so I'm on medication that I take every single day for that. And um, lately because I have been vomiting so much and just can't stomach anything I haven't been able to keep down my medications and um, so my UTI medication as well as like my act actual um, prenatal vitamins and all that sort of stuff um, as well as obviously water which is what you need you need water in your system and to be really hydrated to avoid getting UTIs so it's just a really bad combination of things that's going on at the moment so the doctor just said she's like I'd rather you be on this medication to stop the nausea and stuff so you can keep going with the UTI medication take your prenatal vitamins and things like that keep water down uh, because she said the alternative is basically like me getting a UTI and being on a really heavy dose of antibiotics which isn't good for the baby so she would rather me be on the medication for nausea um, rather than things like going bad so yeah she put me on some medication and I've taken my first tablet and I'm already feeling a lot better, which I'm so thankful for. Finally, I feel like I can just actually think straight a little bit because when you're just consistently nauseous, it's like you can't think, you can't get up, you can't eat, you can't like, it's just, you can't do anything when it's that bad. So she did say to me as well, if, the medication doesn't help with me keeping everything down then she wants me to go back um, and she'll put like a drip in my arm with some like vitamins and like just to boost my hydration back up again thank you guys so much for watching this video I hope you really enjoyed it today was so crazy <laughs> today was so nuts like honestly even just me I realize now that when she started playing the heartbeat, my heart like sank for a second. No, no, my heart didn't sink. I like missed a breath because I was like listening so intently. It was honestly the best noise I've ever heard in my life. Hope you really enjoyed this video. What a good day. I'm feeling better and I got to see my kid today and it's a little heartbeat. Best day. If you did, please give it a thumbs up down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you join my family here on YouTube. And as always, don't forget to check out my online store, www.amalfiboutique.com.au. There's some really cool stuff on there that I think you guys will like and it really does support me. So thank you to everyone who does check out my website. I'll see you guys in my next one and I hope you have a really great day. Bye. I've been